Hey, scholars, good to be back with you. Today we're going to do something nutty. We're going to do some block stacking, but we're going to do it in a really interesting way. Now, I've got some blocks here. I cut these out. These are just wooden blocks. They're made out of a material called lambu that's very dense and very strong, so it works pretty well for this. I've taken one of them here, and I've marked it. Okay, I've marked the ends, and in particular, I marked that end. What I'm going to try to do is I want to stack blocks so that this is hanging all the way over here. Well, how are we going to do that? Well, if you've taken statics or have a little bit of intuition, you know that once the block gets past about the halfway point here, it starts to fall off my little, my little uh, toolbox here in my office. But if we got a stack of them, we got a whole stack of them here, we might be able to stack them in a way that'll get this one all the way off the, off the uh, toolbox. Let's try it, okay? Okay, you can see the edge of my toolbox here, and I've got a little whiteboard set up for a background. You can see my guitar in the background over there. And I've got a whole stack of these blocks. Well, let's, let's start here. I'm going to start one that's hanging just a little over the edge. Well, maybe more. Ooh, there's another one. What I'm going to do here is start stacking them like this at an angle. Okay, that worked, but you can see that the edge of the, the top block is still not hanging all the way over the, the uh, edge of the toolbox. In fact, there's, there's my little uh, whiteboard, and I've lined it up here with the edge of the box. And you can see this is, we're still missing by about that much. Well, hmm, how are we going to do this? How about just increasing this angle here from there to maybe there? Oh, that's not going to work. Okay, that started to fall. What's another solution? The tower of blocks starts to fall when its entire center of gravity moves past that point right there. What if I could make it so the center of gravity stayed over here, but the top block could go over there? Well, that means I probably want to stack a whole bunch of blocks pretty close to here and then only gradually move out. Let's try that. there. It hasn't fallen yet, which means the center of gravity of the entire stack of blocks is still behind there. I can tell you, it's not very far behind there, but it is. It hasn't fallen. I haven't glued this down or taped it or anything. How about this? Is this? Look at that. Not only is the top block past the edge of the toolbox, it's way past the edge of the toolbox. Now, in theory, if I could stack the blocks high enough, I could make this block go out as far as I wanted to. So there you go. This is basic statics, folks. This isn't magic. Looks like magic, but it isn't. All, right. All that's happening is the center of gravity of the whole stack is behind there. Doesn't matter that the top block is sticking way out and it's over the edge there. Its center of gravity is still behind that. The center of gravity of these two is behind that, and down we go. There you have it. They're statics and stacking magic blocks. Hope this helps. We'll talk to you next time.